Can you tune a ukulele the same way as a violin? Spoiler! Yes, you can! Hello everyone! As you might know, I'm a school teacher. And school teachers tend to sing with their students. I do that too. And for that, I've been using my ukulele. I'm playing along in class with the kids and it's good fun. Only thing is, the tuning of a ukulele does not make any sense to me. Plus, the sound of a ukulele seems a bit toy-like and a bit childish to me. Right! Looks like my decor is attacking me. And that's when I started looking around to see if there were ukulele strings with a different tuning. Good news? There is! I discovered that Aquila, which is a well-known ukulele string brand, also has strings with violin and viola tuning. For soprano ukuleles, they have a string set with violin tuning, which is G, D, A and E. And for concert size ukuleles, like mine, they have strings with a viola tuning, which is C, G, D, A. And because my ukulele is a concert size, which is slightly bigger than a soprano, I bought a set of strings with viola tuning. By the way, these strings are also advertised as being tuned in mandolin and mandola tuning, but a mandolin is tuned the same way as a violin, and a mandola is the same tuning as a viola. So, in this case, mandolin, violin. It's the same, and mandola, viola, it rhymes, is also the same. Okay, so let's get back to a few weeks ago when I actually installed these strings. Here we go! So after changing my strings, I actually waited quite a while before filming this video because one, the strings took quite a long time to settle. I think it was almost two weeks before they properly stayed in tune and two, I was being lazy. Okay, so let's do a side to side comparison now between regular ukulele strings and these. a way more pleasant sound now. It sounds warmer and fuller. And by the way, the two lower strings of this set are wound strings. And that means that they are coated in a nickel steel kind of material. I'll show you. These are nylon and these are steel. I was also quite curious to find out how these strings actually sound in combination with my violin. So, here's a short and sweet duet. After recording that duet, I realized that I did not have a recording with my old ukulele string and my violin. I actually should have done that too, but oh well, 
and there are actually two things to keep in mind with the string sets. The two bottom strings, because they are wound, tend to buzz. You know, there's that buzzing. And that buzzing hardly happened with my regular strings, but with these strings, it happens quite a lot, so of course I'm not a good ukulele player at all, so I'm also blaming my skills here. But still, keep in mind that it may sound a bit buzzy. If you would get the other sets with violin tuning, uh, only the G string would be wound and the rest would be nylon. And in this case, the C and G are wound. Number two is that you can totally forget everything you know about ukulele chords, because the chords will obviously be different now but with the help of a little music knowledge and Google I could figure out most chords at least most chords I will need when playing in class and that's usually C A minor F, G and um, well occasionally uh, a D and maybe sometimes an A but that's that's pretty much it Oh, and my favorite chord, C minor. So dramatic! Okay, I think we should wrap this one up right now. <laughs> if you guys have any ideas for nice songs I could play with both my ukulele and my violin in a split screen like you just saw, feel free to drop your ideas in the comment section down below. That's actually kind of funny. They're almost the same size. The violin body is slightly longer, but it's thinner. See? Uh -huh. So, thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you next time. Bye!